Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the startup edition of the 2022 Global Investment Convention. My name is Peter Eisenschmidt, and I am here at Hanover Impulse. I'm with Hanover Impulse, which is the economic development agency of the city and region of Hanover. I thank the organizers at Crescendo very much for organizing uh, this event. I am very happy and very proud to join this event again. And I would like to take the opportunity to introduce to you the Startup City, which is one of the most innovative regions in Germany. We have a long tradition of innovation, uh, not only in automotive industries, like you see here with the Volkswagen uh, bully, which is actually produced here uh, in, uh, in Hanover, and which will see the next ongoing uh, electromobile uh, generation very soon. But also in many, many other areas, we are very innovative. Uh, we have been innovative and we are and we will be innovative. Hanover, the greater region, is the number one region in Europe with respect to R&D investments. So this is connected to a lot of big companies like the Continental AG, like of course Volkswagen uh, and others in automotive like Wapco. Um, but this is also connected to a lot of R&D research institutes we have here in different areas. In aerospace, the German Aerospace Agency is located not far away from Hanover, doing all, all the R&D uh, related work in this field. Also very close connector there is the um, uh, National Aerospace uh, Agency. Other areas we are very strong is in the area of life science around the Hanover Medical School, the Hanover Veterinarian School, which is actually the eldest veterinarian school in the world, uh, doing a lot of uh, outstanding R&D activities in these fields. The um, uh, German uh, National Institute for Physics and uh, Metrology is located not far away from here. Um, and yeah, um, other, other also privately owned uh, companies like the International Neuroscience Institutes are, are active here. And I would like to also to point out to the so-called hidden champions, the small and medium-sized companies um, uh, like, uh, like Sennheiser, like Kind in the field of microphones, headphones and hearing aids, which are worldwide leading and which do a lot of innovative stuff and which sees a lot of spin-offs, but also needs a lot of collaboration. To give you an idea, right now the automotive industry is doing a major transition and uh, companies like Volkswagen are actually uh, looking for up to 10,000 software engineers to hire here uh, in the region. They make the whole transition from an automobile company towards a digital company and all this transition needs input from, from abroad. Collaboration opportunities are being developed here and this is for you, for you innovative ideas uh, you have in your young innovative companies are outstanding opportunities to get connected to the German market and we would like to find a way to help you. Other areas, I already mentioned some which are very important here is in the optical technologies, uh, creative industries, financial service insurance business are very strong with Cologne and Munich. Uh, uh, one of the top locations in, in Germany and also this field sees a lot of uh, change when you think about fintech uh, and again here business opportunities. Logistics is important. We are as a major logistic hub in Central Europe and also this field sees a lot of changes due to digitalization. We as Hanover Impulse, we are as mentioned the digital uh, um, economic development agency. We are focusing on certain industry sectors which we are supporting. My team, the international team, is connecting Hanover internationally. So we are your contact if you are thinking about expanding into the German market and uh, choosing Hanover as your location. And how this can be done, we'll see very soon. Hanover itself, the capital of the federal state of Niedersachsen, the largest, the uh, second largest state in Germany, in northern Germany. With a area uh, of uh, with with uh, people of one 
1.1, 1.2 million in, in the greater area. This is a large city for Germany. It's for many of the countries Europe from probably more smaller one. But the important message here on this slide is the capture, the catchment area of 130 million people in an area of around 500 kilometers. 500 kilometers is something you can very easily cover within one business day and 130 million people are more than a third of the European Union. And this reflects a very big business potential, customer potential you've, you'll find here out of Hanover, which can be, uh, which is accessible very, very easy. To give you an idea what we do, we as Hanover Impulse, our mission is to initiate a number of projects, of, um, of spin-offs, of other activities which help startup companies in the region to develop. And this is also then an offer to you uh, to think about how you could use it, how you could collaborate with us in order to develop your business in the German market. I would like to introduce a little bit to you the Venture Villa, which is a seed accelerator owned by Hanover Impulse, which sees several batches per year. Um, uh, where you find a space and, uh, uh, and uh, also coaching, uh, financing opportunities, etc. We have with the Invest Impulse an own venture capital fund who is run by Hanover Impulse, where we have right now around 25 companies in the portfolio. We run Germany's largest startup um, uh, competition contest for startup companies, for young companies, and uh, we also do then. Um, more uh, industry uh, specific networking activities like the initiative Digital Health City Hanover, which is an, which is an initiative uh, started by Hanover Impulse to boost digital health solutions in our region. But in this initiative, we bring together innovative players and uh, we are also very open to get connected to new innovative ideas from outside and again this here is an example the digital health city hanover initiative is a connecting point for you into the market other activities supported by us or in collaboration uh, with us run by uh, by different partners are for example creative germany largest creative industries network creative industries outstanding important industries for each location where you have young creative people and those people are the people who create new ideas and we are very active supporting them and connecting them also internationally. With the T3N, T3N we have the number one publisher for digital business, a very good communication source. We are very proud to be in close collaboration with the Root Camp, a spin lab incubator, which is Germany's number one incubator in food industry and agrotech. And you're very invited here to check the Rootcamp webpage to look uh, about um, application opportunities for the, for the upcoming batches and apply there uh, in order to get the support, to get probably financing, and, but to get also coaching and to get a place in Hanover from which you can develop your business in this important area. And we are also very proud that we are in very close collaboration with the Hafen and actually Later on, we will have a detailed interview with uh, uh, Jonas Lindemann, who is the CEO of the Hafen, which is Germany's most innovative co-working and maker space. Uh, and again, in our understanding, a very good landing point for you in the German market. Highs on online, uh, also important publishers. Again, communication is the key. And another ex example for initiatives supported by us is the Hanno VR, Germany's largest community for virtual reality and augmented reality, where we bring new ideas, innovative ideas together with companies uh, uh, from, from different industries who are interested in collaboration uh, with young companies in this field in order to develop solutions they need in their daily, daily activities. This is an example examples. Please contact us. Uh, we are very, um, very happy to talk to you, to listen to you, to learn about your ideas and then check how we can connect these ideas with Hanover. And by that, we would like to say, welcome home. Hanover loves me. Hanover loves you. And so, yeah, you're welcome to your new, new home here in Hanover. And now let's go on to the Hafen 
And uh, yeah, let's have uh, the talk with Jonas Lindemann. See you soon. Okay, so now we're here at the Haven in, in Hanover. Um, with us is Jonas Lindemann, Managing Director of the Haven. Jonas, thank you very much for having us here. Jonas, what is the Haven? Where are we? What do you do? Hi, Peter. Welcome to Haven. Um, and yeah, we're here in our main location in, in Hanover, in, in Nordstadt, a part of town. And um, here in our headquarters, we provide infrastructure like co working spaces, but also maker spaces for hardware startups, uh, meeting spaces, a cafe, and basically all that you would need um, for your ideas to thrive. So explain us a little bit, how does it work for the actual company? You have startup companies, you have single persons memberships, or uh, what do you offer? How, how does it work for the companies, for the people? Yeah, great question. So we have about 400 companies registered here in the community of about 1,200 people, individuals. And it's actually a broad range of, of people joining our network. It's uh, solopreneurs, as you said, and also startups, innovative small tech companies that start typically from three people to up to 10 people. And then we have people here that are actually looking for a new work work environment from larger corporations, um, such as the global players we have here, like Continental Tires and all that automotive firms we have. So, and if you want to join this, um, um, we're basically based on a, on a membership um, structure. You apply for a membership and pay a very small fee to uh, higher fees um, depending on what you actually want to use of uh, the way you want to use our infrastructure and um, you apply online we set you up and you're basically good to go in a couple of minutes so you have actually members from the big companies but also really private persons yes so this is at, at the very core of our concept so we believe that it's very important that you have different people with different backgrounds and different ideas basically meet in this environment because uh, we learned that uh, when these people meet each other and collide and, and collaborate then um, usually something interesting comes out of it. So this is what our concept is built for and yeah we do have people from all sorts of backgrounds, solopreneurs, big corp and uh, yeah innovative startup. What I have learned is that people really say that the Haven is in Germany a pretty unique approach to create a community, a regional community, but also an interregional, even international community. So, um, and you do a lot to give this community in Haven, a Haven. That's yeah. actually where your name comes from. So, um, can you explain a little bit what does it mean? What is was it your contribution as an organization? How do you mm. create these communities? How do you support these communities? Yeah, I think it's um, there are different ways we support. So uh, as I already explained, one of the core concepts is that we provide the infrastructure you would need to just you know get going, uh, be quick, be fast, and do not have to care about like uh, things like an office or a machine even. Um, or where your company is registered to begin with. Um, but then uh, we go a little further because, as I said, we believe in, in, in collaboration and uh, we make sure that people actually connect with each other. There are different ways we do that. We do that uh, with a series of events like our weekly breakfast clubs where people just, you know, come together to have breakfast. Uh, it's one of the most social things you can do to have a meal together. Uh, then we have our monthly um, show and tell formats um, called Ask Contact, the first contact. So where you meet people uh, for the first time and, and learn about what they do and, and who they are. And of course, underlying or overlying this, we have a digital platform in place that we created ourselves. I just um, told you about our, our story there, um, which basically makes sure that you can connect with everyone and anyone from wherever and, and whenever you want. 
Can you explain this a little bit further on? Because I know you have really done a lot of efforts to create a digital solution also for, mm -hmm. for these communities and actually a solution which is also used by other uh, co-working organizations uh, mm -hmm. in all over Germany meanwhile. So also again pretty mm -hmm. innovative. Please explain a little bit. Thanks. Yeah, yeah. Um, it's it's actually one of our yeah, most important things we're, we've been doing over the last uh, two years. Of course, um, COVID was was a bit of a challenge for people to actually interact during during the pandemic, um, as it was everywhere in the world basically. So uh, we had to come up with something that people would actually be able to use in a hybrid work environment. So. Uh, either you're in the same space or you're not in the same space. Um, you can find people, you can uh, find out what they are doing. So you would find hundreds of projects in our community that are um, that have been created in the digital platform. You can book, of course, all the infrastructure that we provide and direct message people and also find talent in our community as well, which is uh, crucial to most growing companies. Um, so we have a quite um, commonly used job market inside our community already. So uh, startups looking for developers, for example, but also larger corporates looking for talent and also looking for service providers. So this is what we do. And it seems like it's, it's quite relevant these days to hybrid working environments. So um, as you said, um, a lot of other hubs, innovation hubs out there are already using our platform as well. And how could international companies, small ones, startups, bigger ones, how they how, how could they be connected to all of this? What, yeah. what could you imagine here? Of course, I mean, um, first of all, you should really be in Hanover. It's uh, I can tell you, it's it's a good spot to to start interesting projects uh, and to you know get your feet on the ground in, in the European market. So there are a lot of interesting companies here in the, in the ecosystem. So you have these big corporations. At the same time, you have a pretty nice city, as I can say, um, uh, a good place to be. But of course, if, you, if you're not going to, to really move to Hanover, our digital platform will give you uh, also the opportunity to connect to the ecosystem in a digital way um, and have your company registered here. Um, in a quite quick and affordable way as well. And this company then, of course, could use everything here yes. to find partners, to continue the work, to even also on a, let's, let's say, uh, for a certain time only, let's say, be here in Germany, connect in Germany, mm. um, do some milestones here and then continue at home or, or whatever. So there is a lot of flexibility. Of course, yeah, flexibility is basically key in our concept. So you, you join this community for at least a month. So this is, this is the minimum um, requirement that we ask of you. So it's not really a big risk you take to make your first steps on, on this ground in, in Hanover in Germany. So um, you just sign up for a month. If things do not work out, you just cancel your contract and, you know, that is it. But uh, usually people stay for a couple of years and um, that's but still you're always flexible and you know you you can make your steps quick easy and also very flexible okay so we are here at the cafe that's right and um, why not go and have a look uh, to the other uh, other areas here at the hafen yeah let's uh, take a walk around okay okay so here we are at the workshop area, right? Uh, yeah, tell us a little bit. Where are we here? That's right. So uh, behind me, you can see our wood workshops, um, which is part of our makerspace. So we have about um, 400 square meters of uh, hardware workshops here available. And you, same as with co-working or the other aspects of our house, you just have to be member to be using them. So you just sign up and are good to go to uh, work, use wood workshops, metal workshops, but also prototyping. Um, and these infrastructures are quite commonly used by hardware startups, for example, that build like IoT devices, um, that use 3D printers for housings uh, and so on. 
uh, but also by a handyman or a craftsman who, who actually are building furniture or designer pieces here. So um, you would always meet some, some interesting people when you join this workshop here. Which is, and again, this interesting philosophy you are sharing that people from different areas, yeah. handcrafts, but also prototyping companies, etc., are coming here together and, uh, yeah, exchange also their ideas and their skills. Yeah, of course. So, so you often, uh, when, when you're in the workshop, you often see people that, you know, uh, help each other out, you know, give, give each other advice on how to fix things, on how to build stuff how to use material so uh, this is basically the strength the the, the, the core the strength of a really um, great collaborating community okay but there's not only workshops here there's yeah. also normal office table space yeah, boring boring office the, space. so let's go for the boring part let's go then <laughs>